Roger signed up for six months or a year. A year. A year, great. Yeah, he's happy. So is his wife. <laughs> she sees progress Peter. Huh? Pixie! Hey! There he is. Hello, Mrs. Ricardo. How's this little guy doing, anyway? Okay. Yeah. Oh, if I got a girl for you, I do. Molly and Junior, well, they would be quite a That's pair, right, huh? Did you stop by to see your daddy work? Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. <laughs> I was wondering what time you're getting off. Uh, about an hour or so. Listen, why don't you take off? You've done enough work for one day. You sure? Absolutely, no problem. Okay, thanks. You bet. Yeah, you know, uh, thank you, Tom. I, I kind of want to talk to you about something at home. Sure. You make up your mind about California? the verdict. We moving to California? Before we talk about that, um, there's something that I have to tell you, and you're not going to be very happy about it, but because we've always promised to be, um, very honest to each other, I'm, I'm going to tell you. Okay, spit it out. Uncle Palmer called a family meeting. To discuss you leaving Pine Valley. Yeah. Great, great. I happened to be there. Will was there, Laney was there, Uncle Palmer, Myra, even Adam showed up. Quite a group. No wonder you didn't tell me on the road. You were afraid I would, uh, hit a tree. Well, I'm sure this conversation is pointless, then. Looks like I'm gonna be moving out to the West Coast on my own. I knew it. I knew it. I cannot believe you let him do this to you. I mean, I can see it right now. Sure, it started with all that stuff about family honor, right? And then yeah. the family sticking together and all that stuff, all that hillbilly what? nonsense. Would I can't believe you would choose him would over me. Would I you mean, let me finish before you go jump at all these conclusions? Jump into conclusions? Yes. Look, moving to California before I gave you an answer, and so I took that time and I listened to my family. But I made up my own mind. The answer is yes. Yes? Yes. Junior and I want what you want. You sure? I'm sure. I'm, I'm sure we love you and sure we love California. Oh, honey, look, I know you're going to love California. You're going to adore California. I mean, no wonder they call it the golden state. I mean, they have the things they say about California are true. I mean, it's, it, it's, it's a paradise on earth. Right, and thanks to your friend Max, this is a golden opportunity, right? Let's celebrate. Right. Uh, just out of curiosity, honey, what exactly did Palmer say? You know, you're going to be working in this field that you leave, love. Right? You know, and two out of three cases of American marital discord Will? we'll be solving. You're you know, be, I mean, uh, in-laws and, right? and so marriage. Be very pleased and besides, you're going to be tripling honey, your salary. You know, honey, think about that. Yeah, we need Stop. that. Hey, we don't do that. that. Please, just don't, 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 don't avoid yourself. <laughs> what am I just, doing? Let's just, just it. answer the question, okay? What, what happened at the meeting? You know how they feel. Yeah, but you stood up to them. I mean, you stood up to all of them? I listened to them. I listened to them. I listened to their opinions. Some of which made more sense than others, but... What it all basically boils down to is that you and our marriage is really the most important thing in the world to me. Well, that's why we're moving 3,000 miles away to, you know, to get away from Pine Valley and not I, celebrate. Oh, well, uh, I got the coats right here. Oh, right. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah, it's to financial security. For the first time since our wedding, we will not have to worry about money. <laughs> uh, speaking of money, what, uh, what, what, what did Adam say? Oh, Adam, oh, that was the best. You will not believe this. Try me. Adam said that as long as we let him see his son as much as he wants to, he will stand by me no matter what I want to do. You're kidding, right? No, I'm not kidding. I really think that stroke changed him. <sighs> what, what, what about Lainey? What did she say? Lainey was sad. Lainey was sad, and, and, and I was too. But 
she understands that the most important thing is, you know, the three of us. Well, I mean, she can come and visit. She can come and visit anytime she likes, right? Sure. Oh, anytime she likes. You know, we can, we can call, we can write. You know, it'll be great. I, it's not like I'm going to be losing my brother and sister. I will still be close. Oh, as close as you want. Yeah. So you're happy. Honey, what do you think? Oh, God. Oh, God. Good. You think I made the right choice, right? What do I think? I think that you are the most beautiful, most strongest, bravest, <laughs> loyal person I have ever known. Honey, I swear to you, I swear, I swear in my life, you are not going to regret this decision. I'm sorry it took so long to give you the decision. We're going to be happy, right? We're going to be happy, you and me, wherever we go. I love you. I believe in us. It's been so long since you helped me like this. I miss you. Oh, I hate fighting. Well, at least it's over. Thank goodness we worked it all out. <laughs> no one said marriage is going to be easy. California's not that far away. Well, L.A. is another planet, but at least it's on the same continent. Hmm. And we can come back here for vacations, right? Yeah, yeah. If L.A. can visit us. I'll miss Pine Valley. I promise I'm going to take care of you. You won't be lonely, I swear. I know. How could I be lonely? You know, you and Junior around, I can't be lonely. Expecting somebody? Maybe they'll go away. Oh, good, 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 good. They're not going away. There's only one person in the world that can lean on a buzzer like that. Mama, knock it off. It's our life. We made up our minds. Oh, just like that, did you? Without giving even a, a, a thought in the world to any of the people who care about you? Look, this is what's right for Ted in me, okay? If it makes you upset, I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. You know, every word out of your mouth is like a dagger right into my heart. And hey, when, what about Junior? What, you're gonna rip my only grandson just right out? the bosom of his family? That grandson you claim I'm ripping from your bosom is the same baby you continually remind me is not my own. You can't have that both ways, Opal. I thought the two of you had hearts. Don't let it get to you. Don't, don't, don't do it. Okay, look, now, now, Opal, didn't you listen to me when I explained what a wonderful career <gasps> opportunity this is for Tad? I mean, Max Vogel is being wonderful. You can't ask him to give it up. It's what he wants. No. Look, you can come visit. What am I well, saying? Just, just stop wasting your time. Now, look, Mama, the, the truth is this thing is over and done with. It's been decided. Now, we got a lot to talk about, a lot to plan, so why don't you excuse us and give us some time alone, all right? You know, I'm not getting any younger. Now, Mama. You just won't be happy until I'm homeless and destitute, will you? Maybe so. You're making a terrible mistake, little lady. Goodbye. Opal off the list. Yeah. She knows. I wonder how she found out. Okay, so she found out. Let's get back to those three magic words, shall we? I'm so glad you're not sleeping on the sofa. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. I don't believe it. She always does this. I'll get rid of her. Wait, oh, wait, 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 don't, don't, don't. Just. It's too quiet. Maybe it's not her. Who is it? No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Hey! Hello! How are you? I've got... Oh, look! Little <laughs> beaver! And baby, too! Yeah. I thought it was the bald 
tonight and I couldn't use this. It's for oh. Junior. Oh, he's going to love it. Oh, thank I'm you good. so much. You're very welcome. That's great. Thanks a lot, Babs. You're welcome. Yeah. Oh, I've I got to show it to him. You going to be okay? Yeah. If you no, can. don't okay. show it to I him. Don't wake him up. It. Honey, don't do that. Look, if he's awake all night, I'm going to wring your neck. I oh. will not wake him up. Would you just relax? I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. So? How's it going? She agreed to move to California. Wonderful. Wonderful. Good. It's better than wonderful. It's the beginning of a new life. That's yeah, I what know. it is. The West Coast, the Garden of Eden, all of a sudden. But yeah. did you tell her your stupendous career opportunity that's nothing more than a week long case? Did you tell her? Shh. Shut up, did you? I wasn't ready. You weren't ready. I mean, she still thinks that you're uh, going to open an office out Barbara, there and you're Barbara, looking relax. for partnership? Relax, okay? I'll tell her when the time is right, well, not before. Well, you better bite the bullet, baby. No, 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 no. No, I'm not, I'm I'm not going to blow this, okay? I don't want her to change her mind. You're asking for trouble. Big trouble. Yeah, yeah, it's a uh, commonly known fact. Los Angeles is the cultural mecca of Western civilization. Mm -hmm. Hiya, hiya, hiya. I showed it to him and he absolutely loved it. He woke up and when I was straightening his blanket, so I put it right next to him and then he went right back to sleep, okay? Oh, what an yeah. angel. Yeah. Thank you. That's so nice of you. My pleasure. So? We were just talking about L.A. I, I told her all about it. We'll miss you, but you'll probably enjoy every moment you're out there. Yeah. Isn't it great for Tad, though? Mm. I mean, this is just the chance he's been waiting for. Listen, uh, Barbara can't talk about it right now. She's She's got to be limping off, don't you? Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Well, you know, I just want to say I'm real proud of my husband. And I couldn't be happier. Honey, have you ever heard of a place on Oak Street called Uncle Ernesto's Furniture Resale? No. Yeah, well, I was thinking about calling him up and seeing if I could get a flat rate for all this stuff. Maybe we'd have, you know, sort of a nest egg to move out to California with. Great. I wouldn't miss it. And neither would I. And not only that, I'm going to wait till it's a decent hour in California and call up Max and see if I can get him to work on finding us a furnished apartment just for a while, you know, until we move out there, Great. get our feet on the ground, and then we'll look for, like, a, um, a little cottage, you know, with a little <laughs> picket fence and stuff like okay. that. Okay. Make sure it's not on a hill. I don't want it on a hill because they say in an earthquake, you know, those hill houses, they just, like, take the dive. Bob's yeah, yeah, I heard that, too. Okay, so we'll get a house on a flat area there. Good, okay. I'm also going to call a travel agent. I'm going to get three one-way tickets out to L.A. <sighs> Boy, it's really happening, huh? As soon as possible. Well, I better sort your socks. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Come here, come here, come here. I'll tell you what. I want you to throw out anything that looks like a boot or a coat or a muffler or a mitten or a okay. scarf because you and I are moving to paradise. Great. Well, oh, I got to tell my family about this today. What are you talking about? They already know. No, they don't know. They don't know that it's definite yet. Oh, they're going to be sad. It's not going to be easy. No, it's going to be awful. I'll keep my chin up. Because I know it's the right thing to do, right? 